Welcome to Grubbin' with Cold Moo! Grubbin'. Grubbin'. On today's episode, we have Treats Box, episode 11! Ooh, a lucky number. This box comes from Old City, Jerusalem, Israel. Actually, that's just where the, the little postcard's from. Uh, but these are based in Israel snacks Jerusalem. Here. Jerusalem. We've had a lot of Treats Box. I want to say thanks to Treats Company for sending this to us. Uh, it's a very neat little product they got going on, monthly snack box, as you've seen 10 previous times. Go check out the link in the description if you want to check them out. So the first thing we're going to have is Bamba by Osem. Bamba, Bamba! From Osem is a crunchy baked peanut flavored snack. Peanut snacks! It definitely smells strongly of peanut. Nah. Uh -huh. Just, you know, plain peanuts. Oh, it does smell like peanuts. We are say, filming this on Hanukkah, so... It is the first day of Hanukkah. And look, I found one. Oh no, this is gonna happen. <laughs> it's Baruch Atarunai Yalkeh Olam Barei Meme Mitzunot. Cheers, we I'm, did it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I apologize to oh. the chosen people. Oh, that's a horrible texture. Mm -mm. No, you wanna know what this tastes like? It tastes like peanut styrofoam. It tastes like Reese's peanut butter cup cereal, but saltier. And more styrofoamy. It tastes saltier. The taste is there. I just don't really like the texture. Those need to be crunchier or something. Uh, what's next? Bisley Smoky? I don't know that. Bisley? Bisley Smoky from Osem are crunchy, spicy, barbecue flavored chips. They're these things. The name Bisley is a combination of the Yiddish word biz, bis, which means bite, and the Hebrew word li, which means for me. Cheers. Cheers. It tastes like, um... Oh, God. Ah. Ah. There's some sort of strange fishy taste uh, to me. Yeah. It almost starts out like a Frito, a but then bit. it's like a Frito that fell into a vat of liquid smoke and fish fish sauce. Yeah. It also tastes like it's made out of wheat, like whole wheat. It's wheat flour. Yeah. No. I could get used to that. No, it tastes like this is what you feed fish <laughs> or catch fish with. Yeah. So? <laughs> so okay. Next, we got Milk Chocolate with Popping Candy by Elite. Milk Chocolate with Popping Candy? Yep. Cheers. Oh, it's a crunch bar. Oh, wait, cut that chocolate. Oh, wait, nope. Chocolate that tastes like white chocolate and has Pop Rocks in it. A very, very small amount of Pop Rocks, though. So it's kind of distracting. And at first, it's a little bit concerning. Because you're right, it was like, like a crunch bar. Mm hmm. And then they start doing the weird fizzy thing. The chocolate's decent. The chocolate's good. No, that's where it's at. <laughs> this chocolate with this smoky thing would be really good. Oh god, that's so Watch wrong. That. Watch that. Don't I'm do it, you guys. Don't do it. No. Get out of here. Mmm. I just don't think they even go together. Why do you want pop rocks and chocolate? What's next? Um, Kif Kef chocolate bar by Elite. It's a Kit Kat. Basically. This is a Kit Kat. All right. Cheers. Cheers. It's like a Kit Kat with something extra in there, and I'm not sure no. what it is. Something's in there that makes it really pop, but it is written all in Hebrew, so I, can... <laughs> I have no idea. Um, it tastes kind of like there's weed in there. <laughs> <laughs> the chocolate is really good. The chocolate is good, and it tastes almost exactly like the other chocolate we mm -hmm. had. Um, next is Pesik Zman Chocolate Bar by Ali, which is the... Is this. it the log? <laughs> Oh. No. Pe Pe Sig Z Man. Z Man. Milk chocolate consisted of an inner filling of wafer roll, hazelnut cream, and an outer lager of chocolate. I think I meant to say layer. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Are you getting any uh, Ferrero Rocher thing going on here? Mm -hmm. Like a hazelnut filling yeah. sort of chocolate yeah, filling? Yeah, that's what it's gotten it, is a hazelnut. Yeah, that's good. That's really good. Especially mm. if you like Nutella. This no. is your jam right here. Mm -hmm. All the chocolate's really good. Okay, that's the wrong one. It's good quality <laughs> chocolate. Macupolet chocolate? Did, did you even say a word? Is the, Are we finally eating the log? That's it. All right, we're eating a chocolate log. It looks like Groot. <laughs> it does. Weird. How did they make this? I don't know. It looks like it was poured out of frosting tubes or something. Oh, this is weird. It's like... <laughs> Freeze dried at first. <laughs> it's very sweet. Mm -hmm. It's a different flavor than the other chocolates. A lot more sugar in here. 
But the way they create the, the textures out of like layering really thin nanotubes of chocolate into mm -hmm. layers, into braids that they then braid together. Uh, it's it, it gives you a little bit something similar to like the arrow chocolates. Have you had those? The arrow chocolate bars with all the, the air bubbles in it. This tastes like Easter candy. It gives it a lighter, you know, texture, but then it melts easier in your mouth. But it's too sweet. This is too sweet. What's next? Bisley falafel. Isn't Isn't falafel delicious? just fried chickpeas? Couldn't, yeah. Couldn't you just fry chickpeas? And they're delicious. Is there any chickpeas in here? No, wheat flour. Boy, falafels are good. You go to a falafel truck. I've never had falafel. You're missing out. You gotta come oh, back to New York. These look very familiar to things. Uh, different types of Indian snacks I've had. Where it is made out of chickpea. And they're delicious. Right. But I don't think these will be as good because wheat. Cheers. Cheers, they smell good. That is good. Mm -hmm. But, again, I'm, I'm not a fan of the texture. I am. It's too... They put this on a salad. I don't like the wheat. I don't like the wheat snack. If It would be better if it was corn or chickpea. Put this on top of a soup. Very crunchy. Next. Popco by Ozem. Popco are sweet popcorn treats with a delicate flavor of honey and butter. Use your cunning. All of it. <laughs> I used all my cunning. Oh, it's just popcorn. Yeah. <laughs> sweet popcorn treats. It smells dusty. Cheers. <laughs> It tastes like bottom shelf cereal. You know in cereal how you get it in a bag? Yeah. Like this is the bag version of Apple sugar, Jacks. Sugar Pops. Sugar Smacks. So it's the bag Sugar Smacks. I'm thinking about like Apple Jacks. It doesn't taste like Apple Jacks. That's not Sugar Apple Smacks. Jacks. What am I thinking? Cracker Jacks. It tastes like... It's like a Cracker Jack. Off-brand Cracker Jack. It's not... It, there's... You definitely know there's not a frog on the bo on the cover of that box. Mm, no. And there isn't a bear either. <laughs> You've got some sort of like brown sugar gecko being like... <laughs> Yeah, it's just sugar glazed uh, popcorn. Nothing stand out there. Next is Cola da Grease by Panuki. They are chewy Panuki. button shaped candies with a Mentos like texture. Here we go. What is this again? Is this a it's chocolate like, Mentos? It's a, it's a cola flavored Mentos, basically. Ow, it hurts. <laughs> that is not a Mentos. Wow. That. Oh, no. no. Mm -mm. Oh, no, and then you taste it. Oh, no. no. Mm -mm. Oh. Mm -mm. oh, it tastes like soap. That doesn't taste like cola Oh, God, all. it gets worse the longer you taste it. All right, uh. the last thing we have to do is the Styx Milk Chocolate Sticks by Sticks. Elite. Yeah, sticks filled with milk-flavored cream. Ooh. <laughs> milk-flavored cream. Wait a minute. What, what animal... <laughs> What <laughs> animal is this cream of? What did it start out tasting like? You think you're Jerusalem yak? <laughs> it could be yak cream. It's probably got another wafer thing, huh? Cheers. Mm -mm. Nope. Tastes like another Easter candy, but I can't put my yeah. finger on one. I mean, it's almost like approaching what's inside of an Oreo, but this tastes more like, or I should say mm. less like oil. It's like eating the white part of a Cadbury egg. Yeah, but a little bit more powdery. And less oily. I think they're all the same. Because that's all an Oreo filling is, is oh, oil and uh, and white white sugar, or confectioner sugar. Mm, no, it's the same. Mm. These aren't bad. Mm -mm. They aren't bad. Are good. I mean, they're a little rich, is what I would say. A little bit much. It is a box full of candy. <laughs> <laughs> it is called treats. So you get some treats. It's an interesting assortment of things here. Mm -hmm. I'm not really a fan of the wheat snacks. But the chocolate is really good. The chocolate was most tasty. And I think my favorite one was this one. The Elite, the uh, Pez, Pezek Zim, Zaman. The Z-Man. The Z-Man chocolate. The, uh, <laughs> and definitely the worst of the box, the Cola Mentos. Cola Mentos were not great. That, uh, I don't even know. These must be made out of bath salts or something. Looks like we're going on a... Cannibal Rampage. Yep. How fitting for Christmas. <laughs> exactly. All right. This has been <laughs> Grubbin' with Cold Moon. Please like, share, subscribe. Go check out Warpix's channel. Uh, <laughs> except that he abandoned it like a, a, right after starting it. It's like, uh, what's that place? Chernobyl. <laughs> <laughs> Warpix's channel is like Chernobyl. Yeah.
get ready because yeah. Chernobyl is coming to a town near you. <laughs> Way to go. All right. And like I said, you can check out treats in the description. Go check them out. See what, Take a look. Take a look. They got some good stuff. They got good chocolate from Israel. What are you doing here? Did you guys well, already do it? What the fuck are you doing here? Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of this video, <laughs> rabbit. All right. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. And now here's a special message from Sigourney Weaver. <laughs> Gourney? <laughs> Sigourney, Gourney! <laughs>